Hello everyone, welcome to Occupy Mars, which was released today into Early Access. So this is an Early Access game, and it is by the creators of Rover Mechanic Sim, which I had previously played. Uh, Rover Mechanic Sim had been provided to me by the developers, but this was not, I purchased this. Uh, hopefully it has far more depth than Rover Mechanic Simulator, because after all it's supposed to be settling Mars and trying to survive on Mars. I don't like the term Occupy. Um, Occupy is sort of a neutral to bad thing, generally speaking. You know, an occupation force is usually the bad guys, usually the good guys call themselves a liberation force or something. But also, Occupy seem, doesn't indicate exactly what you're doing. Settling is one thing, exploring is another thing. The reason why it's called Occupy Mars is, of course, basically because Elon Musk was making fun of the Occupy Wall Street movement in the wake of the financial collapse of 2008 and 2009, and he created a little Occupy Mars logo uh, using the image of a lunar eclipse accidentally. But anyway, uh, so I know the history of where Occupy Mars comes from and the fact that they make t-shirts of it, but I still don't like the word. Okay, so basically, uh, the word Occupy isn't exactly what I want to do on Mars no matter what, but We'll, we'll, uh, surviving Mars was already taken, so I guess we'll go with it. And we'll see how it goes. It starts off with character creation. I've already sort of picked a skin and a face. These are, I mean, it's very basic as far as character creation is concerned. You can't tweak the face or anything, you know. It's, it's nothing to be picky about it because you have no choice. But, um... Mission patch. Apparently, nations, many nations, they've probably forgotten a few. I mean, it's inevitable. Um, what do I. Japan. Is that Poland? Russia? And. Or is it. Why, why, why are they down here? <laughs> uh, okay. And then we've got others up here. Interesting. There's apparently a male symbol. I, or is that because of Mars? That's the Mars symbol, right? Uh, but they had previously, you see, it's complicated because they used it for meal here. So, yeah. Can it be Swiss? I feel like I probably should be Swiss. Why is there a Japanese flag here? And then down below... Oh, nope, it went up. Down below there's another Japanese flag. I guess I should pick one of the two, huh? <laughs> um... We'll be Swiss. Thing. Suit base color, black. Oh, well, it changed my patch. Maybe Swiss still? Okay, uh, it doesn't work quite as well. Does anybody have a darkish... I'll go German. It looks sort of, maybe, right? Um, yeah, sure, why not? Suit accent color, definitely red. Dark red. Okay. We're all set. So, options. Game... Mouse sensitivity seems fine right now. Uh, first play, uh, first person view, head bobbing, we'll see how irritating that is. Probably not that irritating. Okay, so I, uh, it, it can go 120 or max. I'll just keep it to 60 for recording purposes. Actually, you know what? Mm, I'm tempted to do 30 just so that it keeps the frame rate at the same rate as what I'm recording at. But I'll, I'll do 60, it's divisible. Um, and we definitely want fantastic graphics. Yeah, there's no excuse for... If I, I'll tell you if there are any problems with me doing fantastic graphics. I've got an i5, 12600K, uh, RTX 2070, and 64GB of RAM. I shouldn't have problems with this. So, yeah, everything is fantastic there. And let me turn down... Oh, uh, good thing that they didn't turn it up all the way initially, that's nice. Okay, the rest we'll have to figure out along the way. I assume those are probably good controls, but we'll see. It looks like it's got a controller... Um, my flight quadrant may not be the one that I want. Uh, I would like... Yeah. I guess. I don't know which one I actually want to have controlling things. We'll find out. Okay, so let's accept Fantastic and start the game. And tutorials? You know I hate doing tutorials, but um, 
Let's see what tutorial. Playing the beginning of the campaign mode first. Well, if you say that, fine. <laughs> Glad to. Kilo power, yes. Now this is a Unity game, and I'm familiar with Unity. I'm also familiar with Unity assets. I frequent the asset store quite a lot, so we'll be we'll be taking a look at these assets. I've wanted to make a Mars game myself too in Unity. Okay, it's ready to go. So we have 3D printers, that's good. I assume we don't crash into the surface like in some games. We might actually be landing intact. Pyramid games. Mars. <laughs> For centuries, the planet remained a mystery. After hundreds of years and multiple colonization attempts, really? this small manned mission might finally Crude. achieve the impossible. Words. Making the red planet a place for us to live. Making humanity a multi-planet species. Good luck. An opening well, at least they said chapter. centuries. I'll give them that. The history of civilization. Music though. Old ITS style. Wild West. They've got all the the tech gimmicks, the little Boston Dynamics style ro uh, you know, bot, uh, you know, robot dog. Oh, you don't do not want to do that in a pressure suit. <laughs> He did not want to fall like that. The astronauts did fall on the moon, but that was 1-6 gravity and they didn't like skid like that. Okay, we get it. Why are you using hatches with like five pedals like that? That doesn't seem good, but okay. All right. Do we actually get to disembark from the ship? Information. Information. Oh no. Oh no, it's Elon's kid. They, they, they're really going full Elon on this, aren't they? <laughs> it's uh, The AI is apparently named after Elon's interestingly named kid. Calibration in progress. Confirm the visibility of the parameters on the helmet display. Okay. Temperature, pressure level, time and day of the week. The suit is not designed for night temperatures. Okay, that's an interesting quirk. Available point for technological advancement. Items and tools assigned here. Um, they could probably. Uh, I I only saw music and effects in the sound settings. The voice should be much higher than the music. I don't. I can't go to it right now. If there's maybe an option for that, I don't know. Yes, having a helmet on is important. Okay. And hunger. So we have a hunger bar. And hydration. Okay. Okay, status stuff. Weather events. Okay. Just remember, Mars storms don't actually knock things over very much, because the atmosphere is very, very thin, but whatever. Test message. The game safe status, items received, weather forecast, much more. Suit charge level. Well, there's a lot of information that'll make things interesting. The more things that can fail, the more interesting it's going to be. Such a sign helps you find your way 
Okay, mission target thingamajiggy. How nice of them to, to explain everything. Apparently, we're working for ERA. Okay, uh, the mouse look is very confined, and actually it's a little bit quick. I can't move right now. We'll work with it for a sec. Um, so these are the tutorial thingies. So I guess we have to do the tutorial thingies. Take part in virtual training courses. It won't let me move otherwise, so... Okay. Welcome to the ERA simulation training. Here's we have a holodeck? Okay, the mouse look is a little bit fast. Okay, let's see. Sounds. Music and effects is all there is. I really want to turn off the... the turn on the voice. Turn up the voice. Hopefully that's under effects. I don't know. And... Mouse sensitivity... Oh, jeez. It's still pretty sensitive. Use a flashlight. F. Lots of tubes. Well, okay, I'll sprint and then crouch. I did crouch, right? Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Open your tablet. Tablet. The version of the tablet presented during the training is universal. The virtual functions align with those you can use at work. Okay, yeah, okay. Can, maybe I should just turn off the music. It's really annoying. Well, we're in the middle of this. I can't go to the menu, apparently. It's worth looking here for additional information. Tech tree. As your Martian mission for Blueprints. There are built a collection. Here you can manage robots. Manage bots. Here you will find useful features to help you find your way around Mars. At the bottom is radar. Enables at a tracking point and Okay. Change camera. Okay, let me Really thought I put it pretty low, okay. Well it definitely gets louder. Even at the this low level, it's pretty loud. So, uh, we'll try and keep it on, but I might regret that. Change camera, third person view. Leave the training. Okay. I, I still can't use WASD to move in this screen. So, number two. But I mean, building and construction, I definitely should do the tutorial for. It was the movement one that I wanted to skip. Everything else is probably important. Here you will learn how to use construction tools. Well, okay. Grinder. Destroy scrap. Destroy scrap. Whoop. It went poof. Okay. Well, that's a bit more decisive than I was expecting. This isn't hard space shipbreaker or something, apparently. Go ahead. Okay. Is this the area? I guess. Oh, we want the blowtorch. Okay. No, don't cut the blowtorch. Uh, 
Okay, right click to stow, and then we can pick up the blow torch. Open your tablet. Airlocks. A ramp. So we have to build a ramp. And oh well, it's nice and green there. And build the building. Use the blowtorch to finish the process. Approach the outline of the building and hold down. Okay, it's number two right now. Wait, okay, that one. Well, I'm holding down the left mouse button, but that... Oh, okay. Okay. Interesting way of visualizing it. Information. Bottle. And then we need to throw the bottle? Why would you want to throw water? We need water. Water is the most important thing. Information. Okay, but I want to have the water. Well, I guess. Information. Okay. Pull the tool and press the right mouse button. You'll hide it in the inventory. Information. Go towards the panel. Okay. Leave training. Well, that's construction for you. New message. Confirm a positive training result. Oh, okay. So we don't have to have to do the other trainings, but or maybe, maybe not. Um, heavy rover driving and mining tutorial. Power management tutorial. Crusher shredding and printing tutorial. Growing plants tutorial, and then radar. Not that has no number. Radar has no number. Okay. Well, suddenly- oh, the music is resetting. I guess this is uh, the cockpit for Liz launch orientation, presumably. Um, did I watch the others? Uh, let, let's take a break from watching tutorials. Let's just... Okay. Okay, message. Feel free to contact me. Talk to the supervisor. Are you dis yes, well we can talk to him. You probably want to go down to the base. Yes, I completed All you required have to do training. Is go this way. I have sent on your tablet the place where you should report. You should check in with the governor of this base. Governor? Wait Thought we minute. would be scrappier than uh. that. One more thing. HSE manager wants me to remind you that you can use your tablet to gain info about suit parameters and peripherals. You can manage them here, change water and oxygen bottles, unfasten the helmet, and do other stuff. You do everything using the touch screen on your tablet. And remember not to leave the base without a helmet. Remember not to leave the base without a helmet. Well, I want to change my oxygen bottle. I mean, can I pick up some oxygen from somewhere, or is that not a thing? Lots of useless levels around here. It's actually narrower than I feel like it should be. And this lift is really big compared to the diameter of the thing. But, uh, yeah, just bare textures, not useful thingamajiggies, lockers. Okay. And I recognize some of these textures, <laughs> but anyway. Um, well, let's just do what it says we should do. Okay, double doors. Take the elevator down. Well, I guess we're still going down.
All right, I guess we can continue. All right, outside. This exterior O2? Oh, it's getting sort of icy on my fringes here. Okay. Usage. External oxygen detected. Equalizing pressure. New message. Can you intake the oxygen? I need oxygen. Oxygen bottle. Okay. No, 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 no. I need that. Inventory. Let's see. There we go. All nice and oxygenated. Let's dump the other ones. I'm sure there's a way of refilling them, though. That's probably not the most efficient way of doing things. Okay. New electrical engineer, right? Welcome to the Alpha If you say base. so. I'm the governor of this wonder of human ambition and your boss for the entire turn. If you want to know more, spare me the questions and look at your tablet after the interview. Boy, if they're gonna have the lips moving, they might as well have it for the entire time at least. You have a long flight behind you, so today we will exceptionally give you a break from work. Let the doctor take a look at your parameters and then go rest in your room. That's all. New message. I thought we were gonna be in a more scrappy situation where you're setting up the base. I don't like having a base already. Well, I'm good on hunger and hydration and such. Okay, I guess I'm talking to this person. Dr. Hannah Lan, Alpha Base Crew Medical Supervisor. In accordance with arrival procedures, I need to take a reading and evaluate your medical yeah, condition. Yeah, and the voice acting is lamentable. Data reading from your tablet. The suit sends the metrics of all the vital parameters to it. I see that for the moment everything is fine, except that you should rest. Even a decent. Did they have just uh, one of those text-to-speech things? Read these or something? Whenever you want to fully recover, use the bed in your. It habitat. sounds like it for this one. And take off your helmet when you're in rooms full of oxygen. Try to preserve oxygen from the suit cylinder. The technical department was supposed to update the valve control of the suits so that oxygen would be taken automatically without having to remove the helmet. However, there were sometimes unpleasant malfunctions and headquarters put this what on is she hold doing? until further notice. So be sure, take what off is she helmet doing there? when you're Don't in a pressurized that. room. Okay, you can go. Look in my office when I'm you not get taking off my helmet I'll every time. Parameters again. Do I have to take off my helmet all the time? Drink water. Well, I guess I have to. Okay. Taking off helmet. I guess, right? Oxygen source external. Okay, was that the hair color I picked? Headphones. Rubik's cube. Well, I can't external do anything with it. Dropping. Lie down on the bed. Well, fine. I don't have something other than my pressure suit to lie down in. Okay, cutscene. Alright, well, I guess... Oh. Okay. Well, while we're in the base, so I guess we'll keep the helmet off. Washing machine? 
I have I'm gonna drink water from the tap. New message. Get rid of waste. Three seashells? <laughs> it's centuries after all. Uh, do, can, do we have to turn that off? Yes, I don't know. Use the toilet. But I don't have a little toilet bar. New message. Hmm. This looks like the kind of shower that they had in... Whatchamacallit. Death Stranding. It looks like a Death Stranding shower. A uh, significant temperature drop in one hour. Oh, forget it. Taking a shower in a video game is silly. Take a waste. What do you mean, take a waste? I thought I tried to use this. I don't want to take a waste. I guess we have to take a waste. It means waste tank. Oh. Put your waste in the composter. Can't that just be automated? It's a whole base. If it was just me, I would understand. But surely they have pipes. I'm with pipes. Ooh. Well, okay. These crops look dead. <laughs> or they're not happy. But then again, there's not much light. So I guess they're green enough. Pick up. Hmm. Okay, so fertilizer machine. Waste tank. Composter. Recycle. New message. Okay. Write nutrients from our crops. Harvest a tomato, harvest a corn. Tomato doesn't really have much to offer as far as nutrients are concerned. I, I like tomatoes and all, but really they're uh Ooh. I just take the whole plant, huh? That doesn't seem good. Tomatoes are sort of weak in the nutrition department, frankly. Potatoes, but they want me to harvest corn. Corn is useless. I've grown corn. Let me tell you, uh, the amount of uh, effort it takes to grow a corn and the water it takes, most of the plant is stuff you can't eat. We probably would not be growing corn. Tomato is pretty good. The tomato, the volume of the actual tomatoes is, uh, uh, these are huge tomato plants by the way, I don't know what tomato plants stand this tall, but um, the volume of the tomatoes is actually pretty good yield. Uh, corn, most of it you can't use, so it's probably not something we would like to grow. The potatoes are great, I mean, you see, I mean, the part that you would not eat is fairly small compared to the actual potato. So that's pretty good. Good use of water. Of course, if you could recycle the leaves of the corn by feeding it to something else, like fish or something, maybe. Maybe then you'd be in good shape. But anyway, corn's not that great. Huge base, too. People working on stuff. Maybe they'll tell me that I have to go out to the hinterland to establish a new base or something. Uh, this seems like an airlock airlock. Let me put on my helmet just in case. I like having my helmet on anyway. Suit pressurized. Helmet sealed. Oh. Oh, I guess this isn't an airlock airlock. Well, anyway, talk. I hope that the rest was good. There will be no opportunity to laze around for the next few days. Your predecessor has left you with a ton of work. Um, more than five months of flight has really worn me out. Doesn't Your sound predecessor like anything, had I would an say. accident. He broke his arm and was unable to fully broke perform his, his duties for more than two months. Now he's preparing to return to Earth. You will face quite a challenge here. Better That's not fine. be afraid of challenges. As I said, there's plenty of work to do. 
I'll send you all the most urgent tasks to the tablet. After completing them, you will receive the next ones. I know you have a great desire to explore the base now, but combine it with work. We've been waiting for a specialist for too long. As you wish, everything on this list As is a priority. Wish. Don't waste too much time on nonsense and don't break your arm while fooling around like the previous one. Before you previous go to work, make one. sure you take a fuse with you. Last That's guy, maybe. Take a fuse? Oh, and one more thing. Before I send you all the tasks, go to the sick bay. Hannah said she needs to do some more tests today. As soon as I get the green light from her, you start with the tasks. The tasks. Well, I guess... Are you a fuse? Fuse. I have a fuse. I want the drill. <laughs> Just instinct. I want the drill. But I can't... The one thing I can't pick up is the drill. Okay, great. Oh, uh, it's dark. Flashlight. Um. Suit power, seventy-five percent. Okay, how do I recharge the suit? Oh, this is a big greenhouse. Very sparsely planted, though. What are you? I don't know what plant this is. It looks like a pumpkin. It looks like a pumpkin. Or maybe something related to a pumpkin. Spruce. Why would we be growing spruce? Huh. Well, anyway. Spiral staircase. Well, what's up, Doc? You definitely look better. I won't examine you. It was just an excuse. Wait, I'm glad is this a romantic overture? I wanted to talk to you about something. You probably already know about Martian Bingo. No, I'm afraid to ask, too. This is sort of a local tradition fun, which was intended to improve the spirits of the colonists. Being in our specific conditions for a long time takes quite a toll on the psyche. You guys ever try Catan instead? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> no, it is not a matter of special concern for the employee's health. The corporation is only safeguarding itself okay, against the Okay, this is an unnecessary I line. I came up with... <sighs> so I came up with this game to make people feel better and to disperse the dark clouds over their heads a bit. The game integrated newcomers, as well as those staying at the station longer. I don't really need way, to know about this, it helped do to I? Implement all the procedures and I really want to go to the hinterland and just it be on my own. of performing <laughs> very simple tasks. However, over time, Martian Bingo began to get out of my control. Well, I mean control. it became unsafe. Unsafe? Participants quickly got bored and began to make up new tasks that balanced on the edge of common sense. And sometimes I'm not understanding what the Martian the Bingo rails. is. She could have like explained what it is. I first. am responsible for this, so I wanted to warn you before you get involved in something. I don't so want to get involved in it at all. If you need my help, and please don't yes. do anything stupid. Yes, I definitely don't want to do Martian Bingo. It sounds silly. What is wrong with these people doing Martian bingo and getting themselves into trouble and getting out of hand? What the heck? Find a faulty fuse and replace it with a new one. Fix and after that turn on the CO2 scrubber. Now we're talking. Now we're talking business. That's good. That's good stuff right there. Please let me go outside. But... This doesn't look like it's outside. I don't, I don't want to do stuff inside the base. Uh, 
Oh, crouching. Oh, I guess that's it. Okay, inventory? No. Yes, I have to. Have a fuse. No, I don't. I don't want to do. I don't know exactly what the order of operations here is. No crouch. And three. Oh no. Okay. Well, maybe it would have figured that out on its own, but. All right, up, left, I mean, up, right, down, and power. I don't know what that's all about, but anyway, the important thing is we fixed it, apparently. Oh, weird animations, and we have to do one door at a time. Okay, CO2 scrubber. Again, early access game. The speaking animations, for some reason, make me want to play Mass Effect Andromeda. But... Oh, even the CO2 scrubber's inside. Okay... Fix... is a vague thing. What is wrong with the CO2 scrubber? Well, temperature 144, fill CO2 bottle. We want to scrub the CO2, right? So we don't want to fill it. Oxygen production. Well, start. Whoa! I got thrown, I, I got killed by the CO2 scrubber. Suit power, 50%. That's a dangerous CO2 scrubber. What the heck? Okay, what's wrong with you? Well, I can turn that. I can turn that. Sleep I can... Deprivation warning. Alert. No, I don't want to get some sleep. Stop it. What did I do? I'm just gonna flip everything that I can. I can't do anything with these valves. Well, it says temperature is now not red. So maybe? New message. I guess we just had to turn those. I don't know. I don't know what they do. Press fill bot. Oh, I have to press fill bot on the screen. Makes a sound. Fill. I guess they mean oxygen bottle. No bottles to fill. No bottles to fill. Okay. Press fill bottle on the screen. Replenish the oxygen. Well, I think it wants me to put a bottle in then. Which is like, how? How do we put a bottle? Oh, maybe I have to get a bottle. I should have carried an empty bottle. I had dumped those bottles, but I think they expected me to have a bottle. So where in this... The problem with the base is, everywhere looks exactly the same. I have no idea where I am in the base. This is the map. So there's that. But I don't remember... I guess the bottles were at the airlock, right? Whoa. Cafeteria. Newsflash. We've got TV. Just moments ago, another colonization rotation of ERA company has successfully TV? On they, they, they've got their own reporters? And are heading to their quarters to rest uh, I don't really have time now. At the moment, the 
Oh shoot, let's just go outside. <laughs> Tired of all this. Alright, so this is Mars. <laughs> um, except I appear to be surrounded. What is going on here? Robot arm lower part. I need to recharge my suit. What, what are you? Open socket. Power. Can't plug into this? <laughs> Replenish. Oh, I'm not, I'm not feeling like I can replenish properly. It just says no power. Hmm. Maybe this is something we have to fix. Yeah, but we're sort of trapped here. I can't get on the other side of this. I guess yet. Oxygen detected. Staircase is suggestive. I want to go up there. But let me save it here and then we'll wrap it up for this time. I just want to get to the point where I can roam around free and maybe drive a rover. But for now, I'll leave it here and say thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.